For the last several years in August, Starwood and American Express have increased the sign-up bonus on the SPG Amex to 30,000 uh, points. And this year we are seeing the same. So TPG reader Jonathan says, I just started staying at Starwood Hotel. Should I get the Amex SPG with 30,000 bonus miles? And the answer is absolutely. The fee is waived the first year and those 30,000 points, uh, in my opinion, are worth well over $600. You can transfer your Starwood points to over 30 different airlines, many at a very good ratio. Of course, you can redeem them for stays as well as SPG moments. I actually would recommend the Starwood Open Business Card. That will actually give you Sheridan lounge access as well as open savings discounts, which can save you a ton of money. Uh, and they usually automatically get taken off of your statement. So in my opinion, I've had the both Amex cards, personal and business, uh, since 2012. They've helped me requalify for Starwood uh, Elite status every year. They give you two stays and five nights for each card you have. So every January 1st, I start the year with four stays and 10 nights. That's 10% of the way towards getting my SPG Platinum Ambassador status, which you get at 100 nights. So uh, these cards now also waive foreign transaction fees, so you can use them abroad uh, for your Starwood stays and not get nailed with that. So uh, in general, Starwood and uh, Amex have upped the uh, game with the cards, even though they have raised the annual fee. Starwood points, in my opinion, are the most valuable point currency out there. So uh, to be earning them and getting the Amex protection behind big purchases is one of the ways that I continuously beef up my SPG account. Any other questions, tweet me at The Point Sky and follow me on Instagram at The Point Sky.